Today we are going to be creating some root vegetables. You're going to start, like always, with your name and the day of the week on the back of your paper. Now, you are going to find about the middle of your paper, and that's going to be your ground line, also known as our horizon line. Underneath is where we're going to draw our vegetables. You can draw any root vegetable you would like. You can have all the same vegetables, or you can draw different vegetables. You want about four or five vegetables drawn. So I have a carrot, a radish, I'm drawing a beet which is more like an oval shape and then has a dip and a point coming down. My radish is a smaller looking beet and then my carrot is a long triangle. Above that horizon line you are lightly going to draw what the leaves of your vegetable looks like. Each vegetable has different types of leaves. We have those stems in the center and then the leaf pieces that come off of that. Notice how lightly I draw mine. This is because we are going to want to end up erasing or drawing on top of these and we don't want to see those pencil marks. After we have finished, we're going to use our oil pastels to add color. Now, if I just draw right on top of that pencil, because my orange is a lighter color, I'll see through. So I take my eraser and I lightly erase, move those eraser boogers out of the way, and then I press hard as I trace the outline of my carrot. Then I add some of those texture lines and some squiggles for the shading of the color in my carrot. So watch as I do that again, press hard for that outline and then make sure you do it hard so we can see it because we'll be painting on top and we want to see all those lines and grooves. This is a controlled squiggle. There I have my beet and my radish. I go over the lines for my leaves as well. Again, I press hard. My carrot has teeny tiny little leaves that come off of the stem. So I carefully add each and every one of those. Whenever I finish with a color, I put it back in the spot I got it from. Now I'm going to grab my brown to go over that horizon line, that dirt, to separate what's above the ground and below the ground. Again, I'm doing, gonna do a controlled squiggle. We're not coloring all the way in to fill in the dirt, add in that texture. Then put your oil pastels back, warm colors, cool colors, and our neutrals. And there we have our root vegetables.